There are many things that have improved in the world over recent years. But in my opinion, communication seems to have deteriorated significantly. People's views seem to have become more and more polarised, attacking, defensive, offensive, divisive, judgmental, disruptive and even conflict-ridden. So much of today's entertainment media and social media is fueled by destructive communication. It seems that we can no longer agree to disagree. Rather, aggressive personal attack seems to be the acceptable norm. One thing that seems so hypocritical about this are the links that workplaces go to ensure good communication. There are value statements, the great majority of which include the word respect, codes of conduct, communication policies, policies about bullying, whistleblower and complaints, and the processes to match. Yet the same people seem to leave work and live to a different standard. The other aspect that really concerns me is that the behaviour of some Christians is no different. I've witnessed polarisation, condemning, judgmental and conflict-ridden communication, and differences of opinion that end in personal attack. Yet one of the most preached about verses includes these words. Don't copy the behaviour and customs of this world, but let God transform you into a new person by changing the way you think. Our lives, transformed by the love of Jesus, should be setting a new standard of communication. Matthew reminds us that it is out of the abundance of the heart that the mouth speaks. James instructs us to be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. And Paul might suggest that our communication be filled with love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Friends, let's not be squeezed into the communication patterns of this world. Rather, let's start a Jesus-centered communication transformation. <laughs>